not the best place to start, but we'll give it a couple casts and see anyways. Oh yeah, it is pretty not too bad of a spot to start. But I'm going to find a better entry point a little farther way up. We'll give it a couple casts here real quick. Let's see what's up. Current, shade, and all that good stuff. go it was a fish what we get first little stop we spot we stopped goodness gracious three casts look at the dude just swallowed it up there we go all righty show this little beautiful guy off real quick got them free awesome first fish of the day let's go what is up realists welcome to on the real fishing today we're out here at a creek i haven't been here in a little bit um haven't been out here since last year <clears throat> but as you saw in the intro uh already got a hold of one beautiful little smallmouth right here in a little stopping spot we're not even in the water yet so we're gonna move up a little ways might come back through here in a little bit on the way back out of here to try to find some stuff and like you see there's a road right there but we're gonna see what we can catch here in the small creek out in the middle and uh hold on tight let's go get in the reel hold on tight let's go get on the reel let's see if we can catch some fish we were just casting from just up there so we've kind of been able to come around get in the middle i'll kind of see if there's anything on the top sides all these little movements and then we'll do the bottom side so do a couple of casts up here first before we move on down Could have been a rock, could have been a fish. Could have been a rock fish. There we go, we got a fish. Definitely a fish. <laughs> oh, nice jump. Another nice jump. Whew. Good gravy, these guys are swallowing this thing hard. Another one did the exact same thing. There we go. Took a little bit. Another nice little smallie there in the creek, number two already. Very cool. <laughs> there had to be more up there because there were so many biting a little bit ago. And today we're just using some Kitex. I've got some three inch Kitex swim baits from the store this other day. This other day, the other day. And, uh, They've always done really well for me in the creeks, especially for smallmouth. So that's what we're going to primarily use today. Unless it slows down, we might go to the Heldermite. But so far, like I said, we've already got two. So, and I'm not even, I'm not even in the creek yet. So the only thing bad about Kitex, they're not the most durable. <laughs> so like I said, two fish, and this guy's just about done. So water going this way a little trickle going this way so let me try this way first it's right out in the middle there first cast here on the other side so in this case i'm going to be casting with the direction that the fish are probably facing so it's going to be a little bit different i go in the current they're going to have to put on the afterburners to hit the bait Right back up with the natural color here. Maybe the white was better. I don't know. I'll get it. So I'm gonna catch on this to get the skunk off this color. I think that's a bald eagle. I can't really tell. It has a white tail. I can't really see its head though. If we stay there long enough, we can get a good shot of it. I think I haven't, I haven't seen a bald eagle since I was a little kid. I 
There it goes. Oh my goodness, so cool. I'm hoping we can get at least one more fish today. There we go. Up in the trees, I think I got one. What we get? Oh yeah, we got one. Went way up in those trees. Sweet. He's the biggest of the day so far. Come on, buddy, simmer down. All right. Biggest one of the day so far. Sweet. Oh, I need to break off the tail. But, owie, <laughs> bit me. There we go. Number three on the day. Beautiful smallmouth. Awesome. Way up in those trees over there. Alright, I'll let him go. Whoa, that dude's fast. We high tech back up after number three. Well, now I'm trying to start keep fighting those spots. This water flow and everything is just about perfect. Probably could have done a little bit more shallow water. Might lock in some fish, but it was a beautiful day, regardless. That fish? Oh, we do. All right. Not to give up on this spot. I was like, saw some stuff going around. Nice little fish there. All righty. Of course, good old Smalley. High tech free. Next smallie there. I'm sure we are recording. We are. All right. Cool. Put this at four for the day. I think that gives us. Awesome. Should be. I think this place is starting to get deep enough to maybe hold some. There we go. Another one. About the same size it feels like. Oh, there he is over there. It's looking the wrong way. Nice. Nice. Another small mouth. That's a good size one, actually. Come here, you. Come here, you. There we go. Right in the top of the lip. There we go. Nice small mouth up there in the shade. Most of the ones I've found so far have been up in the shade. All right, buddy. See ya. Still haven't run into a monster yet, but we've got some good, good smallmouth already. That was number five right there. That's pretty cool. There we go. Little bitty guy. Thumped it. <laughs> so we got here. There you go. Oh, he can douse pretty jump. You're, you're well, welcome to get off. That wasn't too hard of a hit. Gotta replace my Kai Tech. We're gonna go back to the white ones now for a little bit, I guess. <laughs> Hold on, we'll switch back up. Ah, got a there. lost it. Oh, came back for it. Look at my Kai Tech. Whatever that was, was hungry. Go back up. See if we can find what was over there. Got something. I don't know if it was the one. We got something. I don't know what it is yet because he's staying down. Oh yeah. Another small mouth. Nice. Let's open this little spot here, a little shady spot. A little shady spot here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Owie. <laughs> there we go. Another little bitty smelly there. Over there in the shade. Oh, I love Kydex. So they don't last very long. Look, see, so already slid down. Let's right, see if we can get a second one from over there before that guy gets back and tells his friends, hey, don't eat those really cool looking white fishes. There we go. Oh, a nice one. Nice one. Nice one. Maybe the biggest of the day. 
Maybe. We'll see if we can get them in. <laughs> oh yeah. Definitely nice of the day. Stay down, Bubba. Stay down. Oh yeah. There we go. Hands in the way. There we go. Oh yeah. Nicest one of the day. Come here, you. There we go. Second one. I had to get back over there before they warned each other. Beautiful, beautiful small mouth. Oh, a good day today. See you, buddy. <laughs> Behind me. <laughs> All right. So I'm going over there with the metal colored one. I'm not getting the tree this time. Oh, I got one. Yeah, we do. There we go. Another one from over there. <laughs> All right. We have found the school of smallies. Ouch, ouch. There we go. Another nice one there. Over there in the same little school. We're just staying off of them and throwing over there to them. All right, Relos, we've reached the halfway point so far. Battery's about half dead, so we're going to be turning them around, heading back the way we came. But the cool thing about the way we came is the water's going to be coming towards us, so hopefully the fish won't see us coming, and we can catch some more fish on these Kitex. I'm doing a great job today. Smallmouth love little swim baits, and these guys are just about the perfect size. Only thing bad about them is they're not very tough. I've already gone through, what, like six or seven so far? So not very cost-effective, but... We're catching fish and having fun. So, hold on tight, y'all. Let's go get on the reel. So, we try to catch some more fish. You got one? Hey, got one. There we go. Finally got another one. Oh, wait. This isn't a smallmouth, this is a spotted bass. <laughs> well, mix it up, I guess. There we go, got him undone. Got a nice little spotted bass, I think. Yeah, a ton of patches there. Nice little spotted bass over there in the shade. It's been the key today, getting into the shade. All right, see you, buddy. There we go, another one over there in the shade. A small ear spot, what do we get? Or oh, a rock bass, could be anything in here. Oh, man, I got another spotted bass. A little spotted bass corner here. There we go. Second little spotted bass of the day. Over there hiding. He might be a largie. He's got a little bit of a thumb patch, but I can't really tell if he might be a largie. Huh. Awesome. See you, buddy. There we go. Now we're finding some. Trying to find the shade, like I said. Alright, we're back at the start. See if anybody's still here at this spot. There we go. In the shadows. I get supposed to be. What we got? Did we get a different species? Oh, we did. <laughs> Three species on the day. We caught all the basses from the creek. Rock bass. We haven't caught, technically, I don't know if we've actually caught a largemouth or not, but I've caught a smallmouth, spotted bass, and largemouth. Or smallmouth, spotted bass, and rock bass. There we go. Alrighty. Pack it up. Head on out for the day. All right, Realist, that's going to be it for the day. We had an amazing day just using the Kitex swim baits out here in the creek. They were a lot more active than I actually expected them to be. Found some smallmouth, found some spotted bass, and even got one little rock bass. It's a great day out here. Beautiful day. Temperature's not too much. I wish it was a little cloudy because that would help with the bite, but they were kind of all stacked in the shade on this sunny day, and that was kind of the key for the creek today, was hitting the shade in the deeper pools. And they usually were there waiting to eat. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys have a great day, great night, great morning, whatever it is, wherever you are. Hopefully it's awesome. Hopefully you guys get a chance to get on the reel real soon.